Right, the Klon, the myth, the legend, the tone monster of all. Gold versus silver, horsey versus not horsey. This should be fun, let's shoot them out. We'll have to open them up and take a look in the back as well. To do the shootout, I'm going to use this. This is an Analog Man True Bypass Looper to do True Bypass pedal switcheronies demos with. So, let's wire it up. Let's try it. I'm going to do it with a few different guitars. Uh, I'll probably have to check other YouTube listings for other guitars. We'll start out with the recommended settings of the gain all the way down. Treble at noon, output right around 11 o'clock. When I make a change to one, I'll make it to the other. Keep your eye on the blinking light from the Analog Man box to know which one is on. Yeah, we'll do this one with an SG from Gibson, of course, a Dr. Z. White coily cable of pain from Bullet Cable. There they are, the Analog Man Switcheroni box, silver and gold. Pedal board is made by Blackbird Pedal Boards. Check them out. I'm digging this thing. It's got a little wah slot. We're going to have to slot some wahs, but back to the clons. Here we go. All right, bridge pickup SG. Here is the clean signal. <laughs> settings from the manual which is gain all the way down treble at noon the last one at 11 output at 11 that is 11 o'clock <laughs>
show you this switcher box really does work. It's selected on the silver side right now. And it's off. And if we kick it, it goes to the gold side. And then back to off, which is silver side. That's the dry signal. I know that's redundant to say, but I just want you to know this truly is a test. signal dry pretty much the same I thought a little bit of extra presence on the silver one but I think any little tiny discrepancies are probably from tiny discrepancies in tweaking the knobbies can't be sure about that but that's my uh, theory you know nothing's ever exactly the same identical doesn't exist at least not in this room so the switcher works really cool thanks for checking it out